Golf travel bags. We've got some golf travel bags here. They're not that easy to display, but let's talk about them. So let's start down at the bottom. This is a Masters golf travel bag. It's got no wheels. It literally is just a covering for your bag. The strap of your bag would come through here and you'd put it on your shoulder and walk around the airport with it. Um, if you've got a light bag, like it does serve a purpose. I personally think these are awful subject to what other baggage you've got. But if you're traveling light, like this will keep it super, super light. Little bit of padding at the top, but I mean, I think enough padding to be fair. We'll talk about the padding of the other ones. I've traveled a lot around the world. I've never had a problem with broken clubs and I've also got insurance, which is one of the biggest things that you need to make sure you have if you're traveling. Make sure your golf insurance is covering these kind of breakages. It's annoying, I know, but if you get to the golf course, there's always ways of hiring other clubs, those kinds of things, worst case scenario. Um, but there's enough padding in here and you can add your own padding as well, like put shirts and other bits around, put foam in there if you want, if you want to really pad up the clubs. Very, very basic, but super, super light. Then we move up to the sun mounting, which is bigger than the Masters one, and also has the wheels here at the bottom to allow you to pull it around the airport. So handle at the top here, you literally are wheeling it around. This is what I find is the best. Certainly for me, when I travel, I've got golf shoes in there, golf clubs. Um, we have a tripod in there as well, so it gets quite heavy. I'd never be putting it around my shoulder. Nice big openings, nice amount of padding at the top as well. You've got the handle if you did want to put it on your shoulder. I, I personally wouldn't do that, it'd be too heavy. You've got handle here as well for getting it on and off the belt and in and out of the car. And you've also got a nice, huge pocket, like proper good size pocket at the front here if you want to load it up with a few other things. I mean, I think this bag is just for the price, it, it does it all. Like you don't really, I personally, in my opinion, as a traveler for years now, I don't think you need more than this. It is gonna do everything you need it to do. But you can go up in price and what happens then is we go say to the Titleist one here behind me. So we're getting a nice Titleist branding, few more side pocket stuff here as well. We get the wheels here at the bottom, nice solid wheels. Also something here to try and help stand it up, give it some protection at the bottom. You can put your name in here if you want, it tends to come out. And again, Titleist branding on the other side as well. It's got the zip down the middle here. So it's like right down the middle of the unit. But it's the same idea, you're pushing and pulling it around. This one does stand up a little better sometimes. If you want like in queues, sometimes it's better doing this, moving it, you know, picking it up and down. You get these bungees around the side as well to tighten it up. Again, handle here to chuck it in and off the plane and boots. Good amount of padding at the top. I wouldn't say more padded than the other one. You pay more for this one because you get the branding, which is cool. If you want to look cool with your luggage, this one works. I don't see much of an advantage over these ones. And that's not just tight lists. My Strixon one's the same. Um, tight this one, I've had both, they were great, but I wouldn't see much an advantage over these over say the Sun Mountain, unless you just want to look that certain way. And then lastly here, it's the solid long ridge kind of case. Like these things, I've never quite understood these personally. So this is a solid case, like it's solid on wheels. You know, you can wheel it around, get it around the airport fine. It comes open, it's just got a bit of foam some inside connections as well, but not much real room and you're not gonna get a big bag in here. You've got these clips on the side as well to lock it down. They come with padlocks, but remember, depending on where you're traveling to, you can't lock them. People, the, the security need to look inside, so you lock that, that it's not getting there or they're busting it open. When we go to America, we get this little thing, customs thing inside our Travel bag said, we've inspected your bag, it's inside, they've gone inside and looked, which is great, let's keep us all safe. I think for storage, it's a good idea, you know, it is solid. If you're really worried that things are gonna get broken, then yeah, absolutely. This is, um, you know, it's the most secure of all of them. I, I Heavy overkill, if you're a regular traveler, you wouldn't use this. I think if you're traveling the first time, you're a bit anxious, you might go for this. But again, this would be great for storing at home and those kind of things as well, like, you know, putting your bag in or it's like one of those things you put loads of clothes in and put under your bed, isn't it? Not my biggest aim. For me personally, it's the Sun Mountain. This one wins. Price and practicality, 
hard to beat this. It does everything. And the thing with a travel bag that we found when we traveled lots is they just wear out. They get chucked around, they, they go. Like we, I've never had a travel bag that's lasted more than a year. But remember, I'm doing lots of trips. So it was quite funny when we were looking, look, if I'm doing 10 trips a year, they go, they go. There's a hole always here it goes at the bottom. There's a hole and the clubs start poking through. But how many times are you doing 10 trips in a travel bag? That could be five, 10 years for most golfers. So you will get your time out of them. We're just doing it all in one short time. Some man for me. Cost and practicality. And I like that big pocket at the front there as well for bonus storage.